Hey guys, welcome to the channel. My name is Hearts and uh, welcome to more Danganronpa. <laughs> I have not recovered. Holy shit, dude. I have not recovered. I like, I went to go eat, I uh, watched some videos, and I'm still counseling with the fact that this game fucking lied to me, dude. Alright. Let's get going. Well, at this. <laughs> oh god, that's not your voice. Well, at this point, it goes without saying, but you all voted correctly. The Blacken who killed Rantaro Amani is the ultimate pianist, Kaede Akamatsu. So pissed, bad. I just. I, I can't. I just. Can't believe of all the games. Because the thing it's like. It's like. When you go into games like this, or stories like this, or whatever, you you come in with a certain preparedness to say goodbye to some characters. But I didn't I didn't prepare myself to say goodbye to the character I thought was the protagonist. I this is a loss that I was unprepared for. Sure, this, sure we won the clash trial, but it feels like a loss. It just oh man, and it sucks. I'm glad. Good. What? What? I, I, bad. I almost don't even have it in me to bother with voices right now. What? Good? Don't screw around. What do you mean, good? Is this how you wanted it to end? That's not true. Not really, but it could have turned out a lot worse. So this is fine too. I don't get it. It's not fine. This is super horrible. The worst ever. <laughs> yeah. How did it come to this? Please. Kaede, would you please, uh, what would possess you to do something like this? <sighs> Gunta Nob can't accept this. Not unless you explain. Real? Yeah, I won't be satisfied until I hear it straight from you. Hey! Kaede, uh... <laughs> and it, like... And it's like, uh, it's it just, it's just painful. Because it's like, now that we, we are, the, we're playing as Suichi, um, now... It even dr it drives it in further. It's like the twisting of the knife. Like, ah. Uh, mm. Okay, please allow me a few more mi moments of your time then. Just like Soichi said, I was after the mastermind this entire time. I wanted to kill the mastermind and I thought doing that would end the killing but... game. But why did you try to kill them? Maybe we could have been captured. If it hadn't been for the timeline, I probably would have done that. But the timeline meant that capturing the mastermind was less likely to work, you know? Because the mastermind could have just played dumb to run out the clock yeah. and kill us all. I was worried about that happening. Therefore. So you sought to kill the mastermind instead. That's right. I had made up my mind just before we set up the cameras in the library. Thought it was my last chance to save everyone. I couldn't let that last chance pass me by. I had to save everyone no matter what. <sighs> Even if you had to kill someone, well, fuck off, Kokichi. Yeah. I don't have to, I don't have the patience for you right now. <laughs> I thought that killing the mastermind was our best shot at escaping this place together. I really believed it too. Kaide. But. Oh, Kaide, it it never dawned on you. As soon as you that thought entered your head, Monokuma had you right where he wanted. Because what mattered most to Monokuma is that the killing game started. You really don't get it. Regardless of your reasons, the moment you felt the urge to kill, you already lost. You agreed to be part of this killing game when you allowed murder to fill your heart. Wait! Wait, to put it like that... But he's not wrong, she's the reason the killing game finally started. Uh, no. But if Kaede hadn't done anything, we'd all be dead right. by now. He was lying. Monaco was lying. Which means he's probably lying about the blood. Plus, the first perk or whatever it was called. Kaede saved everyone. We can- we know can I know that! I know, you don't have to remind me. That's why I'm so pissed off. Pissed off at myself for being so- so useless. Um... Koichi, that's enough. I can see through your act. Man. Whoops, that's obvious, huh? That's right. But Kokichi is right. I was being played. They didn't even kill the mastermind and killed one of our dear friends instead. What I did was so terrible, so unforgivable. I took an innocent life and nothing but a hor I'm nothing but a horrible murderer. You all hate me, blame me, and be disgusted by me. Wait! Hey, please calm down. 
After we found Rintaro's body, when I realized he wasn't the mastermind, I thought about ending this by confessing to you what I had done. But I couldn't, because of Monokuma's first blood perk. Four. You see, if you confessed uh, there and then, you would have been able to leave. But you decided you couldn't leave this place by yourself, so you kept quiet. Because of the first blood perk, you were forced to hide the truth from us. Yeah, yeah that's right. I see. So the first blood perk worked against the blackened rather than for them. But at the same time, I thought, if I did this for everyone, then instead of making things easier by confessing, I thought I should lie to you all so it would motivate you to keep moving forward. Then... Was that the reason for the trial, to reveal the mastermind? I felt like if I didn't do this, then Rintaro's death would have been meaningless. Well, we were searching for both the culprit and the mastermind during this class trial. Yeah! Oh, Kaede didn't mention that. But that's why I wanted to spend, uh, wanted to end all the terrible things happening to us. I'll defeat the mastermind, mastermind and end this dumb killing game. I'll even use this class trial to do that. I... I never wanted to keep my crimes a secret. I was going to tell you all eventually. But before I did, I wanted to expose the mastermind first. And everyone... Then the killing game would have ended, and everyone but me would have been saved. I thought that was the best way I could atone for killing Rentaro. Sorry. This is my fault. I was wrong. There was no mastermind. What? You were wrong? But didn't you say the mastermind was uh, one of us? Okay. That's what I thought at first, but in the end, we have nothing. No one made any moves at the time limit. The trial was useless. Let's see. Even when Suichi was about to be voted as the Blackened, still they did not appear. Maybe. Yeesh, that seriously was a close one. If Kaede had just kept her mouth shut, we'd all be dead right now. No way, there has to be something else we can discuss. We just gotta think. Right, Suichi? But... On the other hand, she's only in this mess because she decided to say something at that moment. That's... I wanted to protect Kaede, but I also wanted to amass the mastermind. But even when the killer was about to be condemned, they remained Sorry. hidden. That has to mean the mastermind is not among us after what? all. So Kaede had the wrong idea the whole time. I see. All her ask actions were taking under Suichi's flawed logic. Uh, okay. That's why this is my fault. All of this happened because my detective work was wrong. I hadn't been so stupid. If I had never said anything about a mastermind to Kaede, Rantara wouldn't have died and Hakaide wouldn't be a murderer. It's all my fault. That's wrong. No, it's not. Huh? Kaede? Because... I killed him, not you. Right? Right? Didn't I? But... But Kaede, why did you set such a convoluted trap? If your intent was to kill the mastermind, there was no reason for you to cover your tracks. Zabi, it's, it's because she didn't want Suichi to know. Huh? Yeah. Of course, but I didn't want any everyone else to know either. Because I said I wanted to escape this place with everyone. Because... But you guys wouldn't want to be friends with a girl who killed someone, would you? <laughs> be... friends. Kaede put a lot of thought into this. Mm. She put so much thought into this, it drove her to commit murder like a lunatic. God, you're such a dumbass. Yeah. I know, right? Such an idiot. However, we only survived the time limit because of this that idiot. Right. Yes, we're still alive thanks to you. <laughs> that is no solace. <laughs> that is no solace. Kaede, I didn't know how, but I wanted to get out of here with you. I wanted to be friends. Sorry. I'm so sorry. Damn. So you're saying after... So you're saying everything you did was because you were thinking of us. And you hid that you killed him just to stay and help us. How did things... Hey, hello! Alright, alright, that's it. <laughs> what? What do you mean? What do you mean that's it? Ah. Father, are you getting bored? That's right. You know, the, how the pops gets, he can't stand this kind of tear-jerker slop. I can't stop crying. 
I see nothing gets uh, past my adorable little cups. I don't even let uh, appetizers get past me, especially if someone else bought them. Now then. But we can't let this boring display grind the action to a halt, so time to make things interesting. Huh? Make things interesting. Thrills, chills, kills! This fucking sucks. And now, the moment you've all been waiting for, punishment time! <laughs> punishment? You mean Kaede's ex execution? Don't screw around! No freaking way, there's no way we'll let you do that. Hey! Ekisal's assemble. <laughs> punishment time is a sacred segment. You're not allowed to interfere. And if you even try to interfere, we'll just crush you with these here exosols. It's cool, but it's probably better if one person dies instead of everyone. <sighs> like hell am I just gonna sit here and do what you say? Kaede fought with her life on the line, and so will I. Gonta just... will face you all. Times like this, is... this are why Gonta became strong. Uh, this just makes it hurt more. This is just, uh... Gentlemen mm. never back down, and neither will Gonta. This is the perfect chance to test out my Neo Aikido skills on machines! Yeah, I'll help. I can... Mm. Everyone stop! Yeah. You're making this harder than it has stop to be. It. Yeah, it's... Oh, fuck. It's... Kaede. I... Enough, you guys. I've already prepared myself. You're giving up. Why? But why? You said you never give up, and that we get out of here together. That's what you said, Kaede. Damn it! So why are you giving up now? Did you mean what you said? I know we can do something. Don't give up until the end. No. I'm not giving up, because I have you. Huh? You know? Even after I'm gone, my wish will still be here. So I'll continue uh, counting on you all. I'm entrusting my wish to every one of you. I believe in you! I believe that you all will make it through this somehow. You have to live! You guys better live. Don't go dying on me now. End this ridiculous killing game. Survive and get the hell out of this place. It's a promise. And then be friends after you escape, okay? I think you'll all be the best of friends. Yeah. Affirmative, Kaede. I shall take that request. I will do my utmost to fulfill your final request. <laughs> I won't give up. I'll get out of here no matter what. <sighs> Gunta, work hard and keep friends safe till very end. Bye. Well, Kaede, you definitely weren't boring. Well, now. Now then, let's get started. Now then, I prepared I... a very special punishment. Damn it. Wait a second, Kaede, please don't. Hey. Suichi, you better not lose. You can't lose! You can't lose to this killing game. I know you can beat it. It's punishment time! Let's get it everything we've got. It's... I believe in you! I believe in you guys. So please, believe in yourself. It's a promise. Okay? It's a promise. Ah. <sighs> The first death. The first punishment. <sighs> Ice, I, I. Man, I have never hated Monokuma more than this moment, man. I've never felt hate for a character like the character of Monokuma more than this.
The moment it was over, I felt my legs give out under, under me. What I just saw didn't feel real. As if all reality had vanished and the only thing left was a fictional world. Real or not, Kaede was gone. Kaede Akamatsu no longer exists in our world. What the? Why is Mono Kid... Mono Dom, what have you done? Ah, gross, she pooped again. Oh, well. But this tension ain't so bad, you know. Finally feels like a proper killing game. If anything, we could stand to use a little more tension in our lives. Right, Dad? No, my sweet darling Mono Kid. Claim that's collateral damage. This is a nightmare. This is unacceptable. My precious cub is... On second thought, I guess it's okay. After all, I still got four more cubs. Ew, I'm glad you got, you kids came in bulk. Huh? It's okay? I'm shocked. Our existence, is, our existence means that little, huh? What's done is done. What's dead is dead. No point crying over crust cubs. Unless you want to end up like these sad sacks. But how? What, what in the world is this? Are you fucking kidding me? Talk about overkill. Amen. Atua, please grant Kaede's soul eternal repose. <sighs> I can't be I can't believe this happened to Kaede. I like their uh, f fuck you. I, I, I can't even I can't even like uh, 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 just. All this adrenaline creates such an exquisite exquisite feeling of despair. It's moments like this that make it all the killings worth this it. Is... Why are you doing such horrible How things? Dare you? You're the worst of the worst. Does human life have no value to you at all? Hey, um... Hey, I know human life is precious. I'm not a monster, you know? Because <laughs> if human life wasn't precious, ending it wouldn't be nearly as much fun. Extreme! There's no greater joy than witnessing such a display of despair entertainment. <laughs> you might... You, you surpass psychotic by a wide margin. Oh, no. I don't think I've ever felt this irritated. I'm right- I'm with you, dude. You? I won't forgive you for this. Got that? I won't ever forgive you. Oh! Spoken like a marked man. Excuse me. What is your objective, Monokuma? What are you trying to pull? Do you hate us? If, if so, have we done something to make you hate us? <gasps> hate you? <laughs> Who can say? Hey, um... That's your job to find out. Figure out. If you really want to know what's going on, you're really going to have to work for it. Well. Though the corpse fully known as Rentaro may have had a hunch. What huh? is it? What do you what do you mean? What was Rentaro's hunch? <laughs> what indeed? He did say he, oh, sorry. He did say he would end this game, and he also knew about the hidden door. Could that all be related to his this hunch you claim he had? <laughs> I wonder Why you? Hey, what the hell is this hunch you're going on about? Spill it! I wonder... If you have no intention of telling us, then keep your mouth shut. Cause. You're focusing on Kaede instead of uh, her deadweight victim. Well. well, it's not his fault he was useless. He died before his talent could be revealed. If he had lived long enough to reveal it, maybe he would have been more Too useful. Bad. Oh well, his death and that's... He's dead and that's, uh, that's the indifference of death for you. He wasn't really the mastermind, was he? Really me. Are you still pestering me with those annoying questions? Aren't you guys focusing a little too much on whether or not there's a mastermind? If you keep this up, you're all gonna end up like Kaede. What? What? Here. Maybe spend m less time worrying about nonsense and more time watching your back, okay? Right. You never know who's gonna become the next killer. <laughs> Looking forward to uh, it. I can't wait. I wonder what kind of killing game we'll get to see next. <sighs> Damn it. You may have gotten us this time, but we'll get you next time. You'll see. Why? 
Why are you all psyched up? That's nice. Seems to see at least that at least one of you has some schputz, schutzpa around here. I have a feeling you're gonna live Thanks. for a while. God, I hope not. I actually kind of hope that you die, dude. Don't screw around. Shut the hell up. We're not gonna have another killing game. I, Kaito Momota, am not gonna let you have your way anymore. Got it? If you, I'm gonna punch that grin right off your face for sure. Is that so? Oh, really? That seems unlikely. I'm pretty sure you won't live long enough for to do that. Well. Anyways, you guys have a lot to think about. <laughs> Work hard and do your best to graduate because the fun's only just begun. Hey. Hey, Monodom, explain yourself. I get that Monokid was obnoxious and rude, but that the way that was way over the line. I mean, at least we got to kill one of the friggin' monocubs. <laughs> I mean, at least one of them's gone. I did it for us. Ah. Wait, what? Hey, wait, Monodom. Where are you going? It's getting interesting. He's probably killed him as payback for all the bullying. What an interesting turn of events. But that, I hope that really means he's gone, because like Monokuma did say that the Monokubs only have one model, so I'm cool with that. Hey, if he's gone for good, one less one of those idiots to deal with. And with that, Monokuma and the Cubs left, and only we remained in the courtroom. I don't think I could take all this. I can't stand this anymore. I feel like I'm going to go crazy. No. So Miki, you must give, mustn't give up hope. Mm. Is there even hope to be had here? This room feels utterly drained of it. <sighs> what kind of degenerate male cries in public? It's so rude. Um, but Tango, you're crying too. Hey. Now's not the now now's not the time to point that out, Kibo. Just let it be. Rare time. It sounds like this. We should pray for Kaide So so she could rest in peace. What? How is anyone supposed to rest in peace after getting killed like that? What are we gonna do now? Yeah, I'd like to know too. I'm so over this already. That's enough! Oh, shut up, shut up! You all just need to shut up! Kaito's voice boomed in the air. The room went silent. Damn. Every single one of you and your meek little complaints. Shut up! You're pissing me the hell off! Damn it. But the one who's pissing me off the most Dumbass. is you, Suichi. Huh? What? Clench your teeth! Kaito! You are supposed to say that before you hit him! Didn't you hear what Kaede said? She said she believed in you! That she passed her wish onto you! But what the hell's wrong with you? You didn't say a damn thing to Monokuma! You call yourself a man?! Damn it. What's the matter? Say something already! Dumbass! I just hit you. Aren't you pissed off? What's your problem? <sighs> Enough, Kaito. Mm -hmm. Sucker punch is pretty low, even for a low-life degenerate male like Listen you. Up. You better knock it off or I'm gonna explode my Neo Keto all over your face. <laughs> <laughs> fine. fine. Are you okay? Luigi, are you okay? Uh, okay. I'm fine. For now. Please, please stop. This sort of altercation is just a waste of time. Gunta not sure it's a waste of time, but Gunta agreed. Fighting not then... good. When we leave now, staying here will only make us more depressed. <laughs> well put, I agree wholeheartedly. Sorry. Sorry, you all should go on ahead without um... me. Why? Why? Is there a reason you wish to stay in a place uh, like this? Um... I just want to be alone for a while. Just for a little bit. But... We can't leave you here by your s- No. Tamiki, perhaps it would be best if we allowed him some privacy for now. <gasps> oh, okay, I suppose. Suichi, don't beat yourself up, okay? Yeah. Yep, just hit the reset button on your feelings and you'll feel happy and cheerful in no- Ugh. Listen. Being a tad insensitive is important for survival. It helps one avoid suicidal thoughts. Hey. Gunta will go back too. Let Gunta know if you need help, okay?
One by one, everyone climbs aboard the elevator. Except... I mean... Suichi, I don't know how well you knew Kaede. But why don't you try going to our ultimate lab, huh? What do you mean? That's right. Monokuma set the room up, so there's probably not a lot there to remember her by. But there should be at least a bunch of things she liked. Uh, okay. Things Kaede liked. Listen up. Understand, there's only one way to get through this awful feeling. No one's gonna be able to console you if you keep just sit there, you just sitting there alone. I mean... If anyone's gonna help you, it'll be her, in your memories. With those words, he stepped onto the elevator. Before I realized it, I got to my feet. I just started walking, and I headed toward... The Ultimate Pianist Research Lab. It's not as if there would be any memories here. These are the things she was pas she was really passionate about, and that's good enough for now. What a magnificent piano! I would like to hear her play it, if only w just once. Ah, oh, that reminds me, that song Kaede was talking about. Of course, it must be here somewhere. I stood in front of the shelves of the CDs and searched each one thoroughly, end to end. It should be here somewhere. Where is it? Ah! Oh. Here it is. This is it. I took the CD from the shelf and placed it in the player, um, in the corner. Soon a soft melody had filled the classroom. Oh, this song. My body relaxed, totally enveloped in the music. It was a strange feeling, the sound seeping into my body. Before long, I began to close my eyes. I wish there was a piano here. Oh, I would play you a song to help dude. you cheer up. Stop, Gabe, stop it. Stop. God mm, damn it. Pretty song to play for you. Oh, like Claire de Lune by Debussy. Fucking hell. It's a soothing song that calms your heart, like the moon's reflection on water. <laughs> you noticed, huh? Yeah, I'm shaking too. But I'd be a mess if you weren't here. I wouldn't have been able to do anything. I would have been so lost. I'm glad you're here with me, Shuichi. Man, I don't know. I'm, fuck, dude. <laughs> I wish I had the words to properly convey why, but this is hitting me really freaking hard. With you by my side, I feel like I can stand up to anything. You give me the courage I need to take on the mastermind. I don't know. I hope I'm not the only one. Is this working? Is this, like, really hitting anyone else? Because, man, it's working for me. It's... Um, this is sucks. So please, be more confident. Mm. I believe in you, so you should definitely believe in yourself. Fuck, oh, dude. Ah, <laughs> oh, fuck. Yeah, I'll try. I don't know if I can do it, but... No, I'll do it. I have to believe in myself. I won't be afraid anymore. I will face the truth for everyone. I won't give up for your sake, Kaede. I promise. From the bottom of my heart, I promise you, Kaede. Yep, that's our promise. I'm leaving everything up to you, Shuichi. Goodbye. My class trial, our class trial. Remaining surviving members, 14. To be continued. Musical note hairpin. Yeah. 
Ah, oh, fuck. And so we entered chapter two. They were two. so young and talented. How could this happen? It looked like an accident. They were running away from that group. Was it really just an accident, though? I honestly can't believe that. One, two, three, four... Sixteen portraits. I can't say it too loudly, but they were probably killed by that group. I thought so. Oh no. Well, there's nothing we can do about that. I wanted them to live. For our sake, at least. Jeez. I wish they lived. No. They should have lived. They had to, for this world. <sighs> A thin line divides heaven and hell, daily life. Chapter 2. They were probably running from that group. Ugh. Fucking hell, dude. I am serious. Like, I, man. Class, the first class trial was really good. It was really solid. And I'm so wary and excited to see how the other class trials play out. And whatever other mysteries are that are being set up to. Where are you hiding? Come out. No more hiding. Come out now. Hey, come up, uh, hey, come up, bugs. Where are you all hiding? Just when Gunta think he finds some, they're gone. Weird. Really weird. Plenty trees, grass, water, sun, but no bugs. Why? Weird. So weird. Hey, bugs! If any bugs here, come out. Gunta wants to talk to you. Huh? Hmm? What's that? Something on ground in grass. Words written on it. Horse A? Ah, uh, and there's the model dolls, okay. <laughs> Who is it? I'm wait, I'm coming, I'm coming. With the doorbell hurrying me along, I went up to open the door. Hey, Joyce. Hey! Hey, what are you doing? It's already huh? morning. Kaido. Oh, it looks like there's one more that could fit on that shelf. Okay, so I'll keep my eyes open. Uh, um, uh, do you need something? Come on, man. Well, yeah, food. Jeez. I was gonna eat breakfast with everyone in the dining hall, but you weren't there. That's why I came to get huh? you. Huh? But I don't recall making any I mean... plans. You should be at the dining hall anyway. I mean, where else are you going to eat hey. breakfast? Don't usually eat breakfast, so... Uh -huh. Are you serious? If you don't have breakfast, then what do you eat in the morning? Uh -huh. Um... All right. Oh, whatever. Let's get going. The others are waiting. Uh -huh. Oh, wait. I'm not ready. Let me get my... Actually... Never mind. Don't need that anymore. Okay. He took off the hat. He's not wearing the hat anymore, is he? Ah. All right. I was gonna tell you. My bad. I'm sorry about yesterday. You know, for slugging me like that. Huh? Huh? Oh, that's. It's okay. I see. I see. Then let's go. He took off the hat, didn't he? Oh God! This fucking game, dude. <laughs> Let's go! The others are waiting, so let's go to the dining hall. Hey! It was waiting, you know. Let's. Okay, so he's just gonna say the same thing. Just making sure. Oh! Okay, so the next area is gonna be, uh, what, like a Las Vegas kind of looking thing? Because, yeah, you couldn't see that before. 
but I guess that's what the new area is gonna be. Okay. Ah, the color's all different and everything. Wait, let me, um... And I bet now it's so... Because, yeah, that makes sense. Because there were gifts for, like, um... For, uh... Like, up... Like, to hang out... To hang out with Kaede and rep, uh, rank her up. To get a friendship fragment. And now... Probably there's going to be a mode that unlocks that allow you to do that. Hmm. <sighs> Yeah, like someone tried to hide writing in grass. Weird, uh... right? Atua says it's just for graffiti. <laughs> now we don't gotta worry about it anymore. Jeez. Atua, that's even more suspicious. My, my. Oh, are you trying? Are you saying Atua is suspicious? How sad. Cut it out. That's none of your business. Jeez. What's up with you guys? Are you still talking about that graffiti? You know. Whatever. I brought Suichi, so let's get start breakfast already. I quickly realized that everyone was staring at me. Uh, mm -hmm. As I expected, they were looking at me with surprise on their faces. Good nah. Uh, and he has the fucking hair thing of all the protagonists. <laughs> fucking bull. Ah, uh, god damn it. Good morning. Ah. Uh, oh, Shuichi. Um. This game, man. You fucking finally hell. got rid of that emo hat. Is this cause Kayeti died or whatever? Fuck off, Oma. Quiet, you male! Learn some manners, why don't you? Oh, huh. You're not wearing your hat. I didn't even notice. And you could stand to learn some manners too, you insensitive jerk! No, I just felt like it was getting in the way, is all. Uh, um... Oh my goodness, wow. I don't have to stare, I just tug off my hat. It's not a big deal. That is correct. You're, you are right, my apologies. I... I like it. Uh, I like it. I think you look more handsome with your hat thank off. Thank you. Well, thank you, Angie. <laughs> <laughs> How nice for you. Unlike plain Jane over here who turns invisible as soon as her glasses come off. I am plain, but it's the other way around. Taking off my glasses reveals my true form. <laughs> Didn't you know? Those who see my true form pay a terrible price. Listen up. Anyway, don't be late anymore, Suichi. We already decided we were eating breakfast together. This is stupid. You decided that on your own. Yes, of course. Yes, yes. I prepared breakfast for everyone. Huh? Really? He did? That is correct. Indeed, it was no trouble at all. I prepared an Italian omelet, buttermilk, uh, buttermilk pancakes, smoked salmon gal galette. Galette? Oh, whatever. Uh, and for those who prefer Japanese cuisine, I have prepared rice balls and miso soup. Kermi, be my mom. Mm. Gunto wants you to be his mom too. <laughs> mm. What are you two even saying? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I'll show you guys something real neat. Look, look. When Himiko eats, she makes the cutest face. Aw, oh, she's like a small animal. Stop it. Stop it. You're making it hard for me to eat. We chatted casually as we began to eating the food Kirimi brought out. Amazing! Good to not mean to flatter, but all this food is so yummy! Excellent! Mm, it's so delicious, it makes me want to cut off my own tongue. Mm hmm, the rice balls aren't just ordinary old rice balls either. The outside is packed tight, uh, tightly so it won't fall apart, but the inside is nice and soft. And because the rice wasn't crushed, you could taste every sweet, sticky grain, even when it's cold. Jeez. Hey, do you have some sort of god tongue or something? By not crushing the ice, air was able to flow between each individual grain. The triangle its shape itself is less important than maintaining a loose grip on uh, as you form the shape. 
You will find it much easier if you imagine yourself gripping it with your entire body. I can't make rice balls. I can't even tell the difference between rice and termites. Hey, how have you how have you survived this long? Oh, huh? What's wrong, Key Boy? You're not eating. Oh, I see. Oh yeah, I totally forgot you can't eat. You know, cause you're a robot. Hey. Hey now, don't look so down. I'll bring you a broken TV oh. later. Don't want that. I'm not. Uh, I'm not a waste receptacle. <laughs> Kibo and Kokichi seem to be getting along swimmingly. We were having a normal conversation as if nothing happened. But we all knew it wasn't really normal. It was forced conversation. But that's to be expected. The incident just happened yesterday after all. Everyone's forcing themselves. That's why... This kind of forced normalcy is just making us remember what happened. Hmm? Hmm? What's the matter, Suichi? If you're not gonna eat, I'll just help myself. Oh, oh sorry. Uh, hey, I was gonna, I was gonna eat that. Push those unnecessary thoughts out of my head and shovel food into By my mouth. Way. By the way, the um, that thing Gunta talked about earlier. Are we gonna go check it out? Oh, fucking virgin. Yeah, quit fisting over some l l lousy graffiti and worry about your shitty future instead. Huh? huh? Graffiti? Um... Going to find it this morning. Hey! Horse A. Or Horse 9. Something. Uh, on, co on concrete and then in grass. Words Horse A written there. Mm. Mm -hmm. What do you think it means? Mm. Well, its meaning is entirely shrouded in mystery. Not even the ultimate anthropologist knows. I thought it was something anthropology thing. Yo. Uh, well, how about well, how about it, Suichi? Let's hear what the ultimate de uh the ultimate detective's opinion. Huh? Huh? Uh, I don't know. I don't know either. But, but... wouldn't it be? I'm surprised you were able to find the graffiti hidden in the grass. Healing divine. Do you channel the divine too? No. Oh, that's cause of tiny mm -hmm. bucks. Bugs? I thought Fremen were nowhere to be seen in the um, in this academy. Yeah, Gunther think that before, but what? when out walking in courtyard, Gunther think he see tiny mm. bug. But bug so tiny, even Gunther no uh could see it. And Gunther have twenty point six twenty five eyesight. I have no idea how relatively good that is to normal eyesight. So Gunther just make mistake, but Gunther think. Maybe. No, maybe Gunther just see. Degenerate sees. male. Yeah, just make up your mind already, you degenerate. Means. So you found that message while you were out chasing some bug. Oh. Wow, Gunta, you did it. I knew I could rely on you since the moment we met. Huh? huh? What, really? It's true. Yep, you should work Got for it. me. Okay. What? what, you're going to agree to it just right. like that? Be careful, Gunta, that guy's a real liar. Huh? What, really? <laughs> no way. Thank goodness. Good, then Gunta and have a reason to worry. Will you believe just anyone? <laughs> Gunta, you're so gullible. You know, if you keep being this gullible... Now. Okay, dude, you seriously have to die. Like, get the fuck out of here with that, with that face. What the hell are you trying to do, eh? Get the hell out of here with that nonsense. You'll be killed before you know it. Understand? Ah. The moment Kikichi said that word, the warm and casual mood shattered. What's the matter? What's the matter? Uh, what's wrong, everyone? Is there a problem with Kikichi's advice? <sighs> oh, Kikichi, you know should say thing like that, even as a mm -hmm. joke. Hmm? Say the word kill? Has the K-word been banned? <sighs> Sorry, I didn't know. <laughs> but that's not very reasonable, is it? Not when the killing game is still <laughs> happening. How can you be so insensitive, especially after what happened yesterday? I'm ready! That's why I hate, uh, I hate degenerate males. They're all about us, considered as amoebas. Hey. Don't complain if some scary guy yells what color is your blood at you. You really don't get it. Is that the kind of talk that lets Monokuma play? Uh, is that kind of talk that lets Monokuma play you all like fiddles? Huh? What? Oh? Oh, did you not- did you hear that? Don't mind me, I was just talking to myself. Hello, hello, looks like you guys are having a good time. Let me join in. 
Yeah, they're having a jolly good time ganging up on me. Isn't that your fault? Hmm? Ganging up? No bullying. Bullying is not cool. Bullying is the worst. Personally, I think bullying is because of lousy parenting. If all the par if it's all their parents' faults, uh, they should do a better job raising their kids. Why are you even here? I figured I'd give you guys a prize for surviving the class trial, huh? A prize? Rise and shine sign. Rise and shine sign. Um. Um, the reward, right? We brought it up, yeah, but so I'll just give it all, uh, give it to you then. Hmm? My kids seem a little under the weather. Well, even so, they're still freaking adorable. I think. Are you being, are you being bullied? That's, um... I knew it. I knew it. I understand from experience. From experience? Himiko, were you a victim of bullying in the past? Is that why your heart is broken and you can't express real emotion anymore? You're the worst of the worst! Yeah, use your uh, magic to turn the human rejects who bullied you into misshapen wretches. Stop it. Don't want to use my magic for stuff like that. You, and don't make just make up my backstory. Huh? Huh? Hold on, the Monocots bully each other. What? No way, the Monokumas should always get along. Hey, you kids play nice together, right? I'm not a lousy parent, am I? Because even if you do bully each other real bad, it's not because I'm a bad dad, right? We are all friends too. We are all getting along always. Oh, yes we do. See, my children are good kids. They would never bully each other. The bullying will never stop because of people like you. Oh well. Well, I think the threatening vibe we Monokuas give off is perfect. that's that. Because we're a team of scary badasses who are gonna drag you down to hell. Such adorable little Got badasses. It. Anyways, we're going to hand out the rewards you've all been chose you've been waiting for. Listen up, because we got these here fabulous nonsensical prizes for you. No Karina. A marble. What? I have Dragon no idea. Jam, an Ocarina, an ancient passport, and a hexagonal crank from uh, some zombie game. Could that be a reference to Resident Evil? Biohazard? Like the crank you use in the, the lake house? When, These uh, prizes all maybe. come in a bundle. Wow, what a bunch of random junk. Bravo. Oh wait, did he say Dragon Ball? Wait, a dragon gem. Oh, okay, gotcha. Don't know what the Asian passport is supposed to be. A reference to. Yay! I don't get why these are prizes, but aren't they lovely anyway? What? What's all this crap? What are we supposed to do with this? Honestly, I'm not sure. Maybe there's a way to use them without knowing what they're for. Who cares? Just put your best foot forward. It's easier to move forward than backwards. How nice. No. Don't get inspired by him, Gunta. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like Sumigi's just gonna take the, on this role of always like correcting Gunta's like <laughs> like he meant um logic pathways. Anyways, that's the situation, so just do your best however you please. Let's go. You're gonna get uh you gonna get a paycheck for uh, all the bullying you uh, by attacking us in our secret weak point. Secret weak point? You mean the nape of our necks? No, not that. Anything but that. Wait, so the nape of your necks is your is your weak point? I would never do that. I just want to get along. What? Get along? Really? You stupid! Don't let him fool ya. He killed Mono Kid, remember? So long. Farewell. Seeing that robot looking one uh, get left out makes me think of Kibo. Huh? Am I really excluded? Yeah. So what should we do with this junk? Maybe we should. We need to use though these on those mysterious things all over the campus. And what happens when we do? Uh, I'm not sure. See? We probably have to use Orcarina by that one Monokuma tablet with the musical notes on it. I'm thinking. Uh, well, we will know once we try. I'll take the junk then. Nah. No, let's leave this to Soichi. Huh? 
What? Me? Hey! You're the ultimate detective, yeah? You should be good at weirdo puzzles like this. So I'm gonna leave it to you. Uh, okay. Okay, I'll try. Yeah. Man, what ifs? I guess that's fine. So I need to go around the academy and figure out what these mysterious objects are for. Alright, let's get going. And, okay, we finally got in control of ourselves again. Um, but we'll see what these mysterious objects do in the next video, guys. So until then, take care.